uh, fashion trends. <coughs> a very nice topic. Uh, we are going to talk not only about what is the vocabulary for uh, talking about fashion, but also we are going to talk about how we personally like to dress, how we like to wear in certain um, situations. Uh -huh. For example, look at this bird, this design. I don't know, in my point of view, <laughs> it's very trendy. Uh -huh. oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Yes, she looks very trendy. For some people, it can be shocking. You can say, what is it? But maybe in her planet, she can be very trendy. <laughs> <laughs> well, some persons like this extravagance, no? Yeah, that's this it. This kind of extravagance, but uh, uh, other persons don't, don't like that. But yeah. for, well, teacher, the, the, the designers have uh, many times have uh, crazy ideas about the, the, the fashion. Oh, yes, they are very creative. Yes, but uh, some are crazy, no? Ideas crazy, but well, this is the, the, the point, no? For, for the, uh, uh, how, how do you say, when they have this ability or, or uh, well, the, the, they need this kind of, uh, for example, imagine, 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 or, yes. For create create the the anything for example shoes bags uh, dress uh, clothes or whatever no aha uh -huh, yes you're right and so <coughs> something that attracts my attention about this is that uh, fashion can be something so subjective because uh, okay. for example for me it can be shocking maybe for you can be trendy for some people also can be beautiful and so everybody have a, a very different opinion on the same topic and so that's nice teacher and sometimes the the, the, the well some the, uh, for example uh, clothes sometimes the color <coughs> uh <-huh. laughs> I'm sorry teacher Oh, it's a, uh, okay. it's a cough. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Yeah, yeah, I, I am copying you. <laughs> yeah, I, I, told, I said, mm, Kyle, <laughs> uh, my host uh, well, well, I, I, <laughs> well, I want to tell you, um, sometimes the colors, it's uh, very important for the person's teacher because they, uh, some colors are for serious person and, and, the colors talk uh, about the how did the designer feel or how the design designer um, uh, imagine the, the that season teacher well this is my opinion because some <laughs> colors the, the black and white all time is present in on fashion times no on yeah. fashion uh, pasarelas no but yeah, now i in, in some uh, uh, um, in some uh, pasarelas, teacher, I don't know how to say that word. Uh, uh, fashion parades. Uh -huh, the fa fa fashion parades. Now I look the colors or the 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 colors, for example, the 40 or 50 years ago again. The 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 the, the fashion, for well, example. Fashion. Yes, because the 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 fashion. Uh, Repeat again, for example, 40 years uh, uh, in a, uh, ago, in, I look in the, in the movies that, that uh, for example, the new uh, fashion for this uh, season, no? And I say, it's, it's good, it's, it's nice, because many uh, dresses or, or other clothes are, it was uh, nice, and the colors, uh, happy colors, no? Uh -huh. and, and I say it's, it's, it's well. I don't know if the if the designers um, don't have uh, ideas, but they take again the the, the old fashioned teacher. Uh huh. They they retake. 
mm -hmm. uh, old fashioned and it's nice. But even, even you know what, I think that, uh, well, in my case, I don't like it because as you said, we, don't they have anything new or they didn't want to, to create more or what happened? Mm -hmm. But it's nice in a way also because it is history. Yeah. So by that time, by that mean, we can remember how people wore in, or how people used to wear in that uh, time. Mm -hmm. So yes, it's nice. For and example, teacher, these kind of dresses <coughs> that you have in the pictures, this new, this is new, this option for, of, for example, the, 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 the I, how do you say ramas, teacher? Branches. Branches. This, this dress with the branches, I never see in other time. Before. No. <laughs> I, I said, oh my, what is it? Yeah, tree or a witch. I, the first time I saw her, I thought that she was like the, the witch. Uh, yes, because it's very serious. Yeah. Do you remember the, that movie picture? The, what? the Blair Witch? No. Like, uh, no? No. Well, for me, it was something like a witch in the woods. Oh. Well, the, the lady is serious. And the, and the design is serious too. Yeah, a little melancholic. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, something like that. That's nice because we can uh, think how the the author of that uh, of that clothes mm -hmm. try to reflect or it's what very, it's very interesting about the what what is the what what uh, the designer think when he takes the decision to create this kind of for example this kind of dress it's very interesting what is, what they think about uh, the life, the natural uh, life, or 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 the, uh, the maybe the, maybe he or she he was uh, sad. Aha! Uh -huh, yes, that's it. What was the intention? Yes, because I I I can believe everything, but only I can I don't believe it. They are happy when they create create this dress. Uh -huh, that's it. <laughs> it don't reflect happiness. No, okay. and not, nothing. Yeah, and you said something so important. What do we reflect about our wearing? Mm -hmm. And so, yes, uh, for example, when you see a person that is all of the time wearing dark colors, you may think that that person is sad that the person is so serious or even that he or she is a person difficult to deal with. Mm -hmm. You said, oh, no, no, I have to be very serious. I have to be very formal because he or she looks like that. Teacher, when you, well, every morning you take the clothes that you want um, to use, uh, that uh, in this day, you know, and, and the colors and the clothes, it depends how do you feel. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's it. What what you are going to wear mm -hmm. it depends on your mood many, well, most of the times. Yes, teacher. And many persons I know, uh, they use a, a dark colors, uh -huh. browns, gray. They wear, mm -hmm. they wear dark colors. And young people too, teacher. Yes. Young people too. And when, 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 sorry, teacher. When I go to the stores, I take yellows, orange, greens, blues, whites, yeah, <laughs> and, well, yes. and black, blacks too, blacks too, because the black oh, never. How do you say fight? That never. Yeah, <laughs> she, she so be Yes, you need all the time uh, a little black uh, clothes. Yeah, some black clothes are classy. Yes, teacher, because it was the nice maybe somebody buy you a, a, a 
party or go outside to the dinner. I don't know. No? And the black is formal too. It depends yeah. how do you is uh, how do you use that. Uh -huh. and and you it is very easy also to fit with some other colors. Mm -hmm. So you can use you can wear for example black and yellow, black and pink, black and blue, and it fits perfectly. Yes, teacher. And some people don't like nothing black. Uh -huh. Maybe some, because they are depressive and they don't want any nothing. Black. Yeah, any other color. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's it. And so, what are your favorite colors? Oh, blue. Wow. Blue. And next is green. And next, orange. And wow. Next, white. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Folklore. Folklore. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for, for clothes. Hey, that's nice. And so, uh, how do you prefer to wear? When you go to a very formal event, for example, let's talk about a job interview. Mm. For interview, teacher? Yeah, for a job interview. How? What? Well, would teacher, I, I prefer take um. Well, some some white, maybe my blouse. And uh -huh. and and. Well, teacher, the, the white color is, is, a, uh, is, is, is clean. And, and I, I, in, my, in, my, in my idea, I think when you use your white uh, clothes, you reflect that you are clean. This is my idea. I don't know. Uh -huh. but, yeah, you're right. But sometimes I use that white. And it depends on where, for example, in this country, teacher, we have the four seasons. And uh -huh. a little spring, but the other three, it's the seasons. The autumn is autumn, the winter is winter, the summer is summer. Uh -huh. and, 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 and if you, for example, if it's too much hot, it's impossible you use pants. You wear. You wear, yes. You wear pants, teacher. It's impossible. It's too much hot outside. Oh my! Well, you need you need use shorts to wear. To I yes I I use I wear shorts and I can use our I can wear a gray uh, short or for example uh, blue or it depends. But I don't like white the uh, black colors uh, in the day. Mm -hmm, that's it's it. It's impossible, teacher, because the bl black colors are hot. And the colors, uh, for example, <coughs> black or brown or this, this for example, the dark green, it's, it, they, they are hot <coughs> for the daytime. Yes, and, too much. Yes, and, and, and this, and, the, and then for example, in, in the last spring and, and all summertime, we well, I use uh, colors. Uh, uh, how do you say, teacher? Alegre, happy. Uh, all the colors. Yes, all the colors, mm -hmm, teacher. But no, no, no dark colors. Yes, that's it. Yeah, and you are very uh, right when you say that dark colors attract the temperature. No, like. Yeah, we, we have in uh, the summertime, uh, we have uh, 40 degrees or more, My and goodness. it's too much, too much hum humidity, uh -huh. too much humidity, and, and when you finish your shower, and you take the, the towel, and oh my goodness, you are, uh, you are sweating, yes, you are sweating again. Oh my! No. <laughs> it, it's a it's a high contrast, no, with the winter and with the summertime. Yes, teacher, it's, it's, it's a, sometimes it's heavy, but well, I prefer summertime. Uh -huh. One thousand, <laughs> one thousand uh, pieces. Times. Times. I prefer summertime, teacher. Oh yes, yes, because. With the temperatures that you face in winter, 
are incredible. Yes, teacher, I tell you. That some weeks ago, the temperature is under zero. Oh my. And all the, oh, now I'm happy, teacher, because now I'm, this is springtime. Well, it's a little, little, little cold, but I think the winter time, bye bye, is gone. Mm. <laughs> Finally. Yeah. At last, yes. <laughs> yes, teacher. All right, pretty good. And tell me, Paloma, how do you prefer wearing when you go party? Mm, teacher, when I go to the party, I prefer use a blouse. Um, yeah. I, I prefer wear blouse, uh, the light colors, and, and if it's a summertime, I use shorts. And it is not summertime. I use uh, maybe a uh, pants, the the um, tela delgada. Teacher, how do you say? It? A thin? Uh, thin, thin fabric. Thin fabric. Yes, teacher. And colors. Um, maybe if it's a wedding party, I take my black uh, pants. Or if not, I can use the gray colors, uh, light. Uh -huh, that's it. Well, maybe maybe also to wear something in beige could be classy. Maybe, but in my in my opinion, teacher, I think the brown colors. No, I don't like how I look. Uh -huh, that's very important. Yes, I, I I don't like to to me the the, the brown colors. Well, uh -huh. but I have two I have two pieces. In, in color, um, for example, in in brown colors, but it's a uh, it's only two pieces only. Uh -huh. hey, Not, too much. <laughs> Not too much. Not too much. That's okay. All right. You know what? I don't prefer to wear brown even. Uh, no. I don't. I don't know why, but in in my wardrobe. I don't have anything brown. No? No. Nothing. Anything brown, anything purple. But I don't know why I like purple. I should. Well, teacher, the purple, it is no common color. No, it's not a common it color. It's nice. It's nice color. Yeah, but you are right. It is not common. I don't no, know why. Not it's all, not all, uh, do you can take maybe a... Uh, some piece of uh, violet or purple color in the autumn time. Aha, uh -huh, that's it, you're right. Mm -hmm. It's more fashionable. Yes, teacher. It's the same for the black, for example, this dress. Maybe it's the, the autumn, winter time. Aha, uh -huh, that's it. It's I fancy this one for winter time, I guess. Mm -hmm. Or you're yes. right, maybe in the autumn. color. The colors is a very uh, important every season. Mm -hmm. That's it. All right, eh? pretty good. And how do you prefer wearing when you go to the movies, for example? Casual, teacher. I prefer use my casual clothes. Uh huh. That's teacher, great. it is incredible, but in this part, well, I, I, I tell you in this part of the country, I think it's an old country because the the customs, uh, it's correct to say, las costumbres, the customs? Uh, the uses. Uh, the uses is for all the people because all the Americans is the same, no? Have the same uh, uses. But uh, the, 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 the American people, they don't... Uh, well, not all, all people, but many people uh, don't uh, use formal clothes. Only the persons who use formal clothes are the persons who, the people who work in the office, the city, and the companies, uh, they use that. But they uh, wear. wear. But the, the, the other persons wear uh, shirts, shirts. Uh, 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 um, summertime casual clothes. Uh huh. Very casual. 
they can use no they don't use a shoes uh formal shoes they use a chancla they yes. use a sweater <laughs> They, I, they were, sorry teacher, I promise, I promise I repeat no, 1,000, 1,000 times, and I write 1,000 times in my book that I wear. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah, because you know what, we, we can use the verb uh, wear when we are referring on everything that we have on. Uh, okay. Twitter, pants, uh, shirts. Everything about clothes and even everything about garments. For example, bracelets, mm -hmm. eyeglasses. Mm -hmm. and the other verb use is uh -huh. when you do, uh, uh, have something to do with, for example, I use a pencil for writing. Okay. Yeah, that's the, the difference. Teacher, when you take something for to do, uh, for example, now you're writing or maybe for uh, cooking or whatever other, the, the, I use the this verb, use. Aha, uh -huh, that's it. For example. But when you put something in your body, is wearing? Is wearing, yes, that's it. For example, okay. we use the computer for having communication. Okay. But you don't know what I am wearing now in this moment. You don't know if I am wearing a pair of jeans or maybe a Bermuda. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's it. That's the use. Okay. All right. Pretty good. You know Thank what? You, <laughs> no, my pleasure. You know what? When I go to the beach, mm -hmm. I I don't like to wear a bathing suit. No. I don't like to feel uh, all of the time the sand next to my body. <laughs> it's me a lot. I like it. I really love it. But to have the 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 sand in my clothes, it's really uh -huh. to me. You have allergy to the sand? No, 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 I'm not allergic. But my skin is very easily irritable. Um, well, teacher, to me it's the same there. I don't like I don't like to feel the sand in the inside my inside my clothes or uh, what? How do you say traje de baño, teacher? Bathing suit. Bathing suit, but no problem. It's only for a few hours. I can uh, I I am tolerant for that. Yeah, but, that's it. But yeah. cultural, cultural uh, about the the body suit teacher, the the cultures are different about that. For example, the American people, the the for example the ladies, they they use the, the they wear they wear they wear the the body suit suit uh, and she don't well, they don't have a. Uh, no les da pena, o sea, they... They, uh, they are not embarrassed. Yes, they, uh, if they are fat or they are thin, no. They don't have any problem, but for the Latin American, uh, Latin American or Latin persons or other cultures, it's very different. Uh -huh, they do. don't use a uh, very suit. The, and, they use shorts, they wear shorts and uh, camiseta shirts. T-shirts. T-shirts. And, and they ask me, why, no? I, I use my bed suit and I don't have problems. Many times ago, many years ago, I finished with that idea, no? <laughs> if I don't like my body, if, if I am a, I am not a, I'm a teacher, I don't, I, I have 51 years, for please. I have, well, I I wear this kind of, of, of clothes when I am a teenager or when I was a young. But now I, I have 51 and say, hey, 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 that problem finished many years ago. Now <laughs> That's I it. only need to enjoy my time. This is my time, this is my body, and okay. 
Hey, that's beautiful. Yes. yes you know what? It's, it's, the problem is inside the mind. Uh -huh, that's it. Yes. No, my problem is with the sand. <laughs> no, teacher. Many times, for example, we, well, I, I, I talk about me. I say, hey, I don't have that body. I, I would like to have that body. But you, one time you was a young, you have that body, no? Now it's different. The body change with the time, with the years. Yes, it changes. Yes, teacher. And well, the time is, is a, uh, it, it's hard. <laughs> <laughs> That time for anybody. <laughs> yes, teacher. And, and well, I like my body, but I, I go to the gym. I I well, I prepare my food. A few times I go to the outside to the restaurant. A few times, and and well, I I to do many things for for have a good health and well. Keep my body in other conditions. <laughs> yeah, keep, keep your body fit. Yes, but my, it's very difficult, teacher. Very difficult. Yeah, that's it. Even here in Mexico, whenever you find tacos, oh, you forget my. everything about fit. <laughs> oh, my goodness. You say, it's, just it's one. It's the best place when I, uh, when I will go when I come back home one day. I don't eat tacos, altizón. Oh, yeah. They are great. <laughs> yes, teacher. Well, when we uh, go to the disco, when finish the disco club, all times we go, the next step is tizón. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's it. It is, it is so funny sometimes, now whenever we do the... Uh, uh, how do you say the promises that we do at first of the year? The propositos. Uh -huh. We say them. Oh, I don't remember how to say that. Oh my, how could I forget it? <laughs> well, when we do uh, the resolutions, whenever we do the uh, fair, the start of the year resolution, the new year uh -huh. resolution. <laughs> Many times we say, this year I am going to decrease my weight. Yes, I'm going to lose weight. <laughs> this year, now I am going to be serious about losing weight. <laughs> <laughs> and the next year we say, now I am going to forget everything about fashion and trends. <laughs> <laughs> he said, well, the last year, well, and the new year, I, I don't, well, I don't remember think about my new uh, objectives of my new goals for this year. For example, all the time I say, oh, yes, I need lots of weight, I, I need it. But this year, I don't put in my list that, and I, now, I think I lost, in uh, the last December, the doctor uh, take my weight, and she tell me I have, 152 pounds, 152 pounds, and I, uh, the last week I tell you, well, I, uh, I have my escape, and I say, okay, okay, let's go, and teacher, I lost um, 20 pounds. Wow, hey, that's great, how did you do it? Teacher. I I don't know, but I go to the gym and not every every day. No, three days, four days. It depends on my my scheduled job. Uh -huh. Three or four days a week. Yes, and I take well, maybe one hour, one hour and half. And and teacher, I now I I cooking my food. Oh, good. Yeah, and that's... the job and the job teacher también. It's a, it's it's a, it, sometimes it's very hard. Uh -huh. Yeah, too much. Yes, teacher. And well, I am happy. Yes, I'm happy because I lost 20 pounds. Is this kilos, teacher? Uh -huh. It's kind of like 10 kilos. Yes, teacher. And, and I have many years I can do with that. Only I lost one pound or two pounds. And I am, and I say, oh, I'm happy. 
No, I am very happy now. Congratulations. <laughs> that was great. Yes, teacher. And I feel better. Aha, uh -huh, that's it. You can be uh, more relaxed. You can also walk very easily. You can run with no difficulty. Teacher, oh, oh, my legs, I, I feel better. Aha, uh -huh, that's it. Your knees. Yes, teacher, my knees. Hey, that's oh, oh. And all your body, uh, you can feel different. Uh -huh. Hey, congratulations to you. That you. And I go for other 10, <laughs> for other 10 kilos. <laughs> hey, that's great. Yeah, you can do it. Just do it. All right. So, you know what? Let's go to another image. Uh, here we are going to have some vocabulary exponents mm -hmm. that can help us for talking about uh, fashion and trends. For example, here we can see expensive. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, I, what I did, I don't know. Okay, expensive. Do you know what those expensive mean? Car. Uh -huh. Can you find the opposite of expensive here? Cheap. Excellent. Why don't you do me a favor? Let's use yes. the opciones. There you are uh -huh. going to find anotar. Yes. And can you solve this exercise by writing the, 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 the answers here? For example, um, here the opposite of long is... E short. Okay. Yeah, could you? Okay. Mm -hmm. And the comfortable is uncomfortable. Uh -huh, that's it. So letter, letter B. Letter B. Excellent. Hey, eh? pretty good. Flat. Flat. It's a high heating. Excellent. Pretty Flat is uh, the shoes. Well, the Yes, see. Yes, it's when you are talking about. Okay, it's letter C. Mm -hmm. Oh, teacher, I don't know if I. Okay, yeah, I read that. And the other brand, new, it's um, old, no. It's old fashioned, no. Ah. Uh, brand new and old fashioned. I don't know what's been shabby, baby. Shabby. Shabby is... Because brand new is something new, no teacher? Yes, that's it. I think that the opposite of shabby is brand new. Shabby is when you are wearing very old clothes, very uh, colorless clothes, and some of them are torn. Uh -huh. So they are old. Okay. Okay, this is the opposite. Mm, short is a uh, long and trendy is a um, second hand teacher. Um, no, I don't know. Well, I don't plan some words. I don't know what means. You know what? I don't. I don't understand what means. Do. Do. It's whenever it is something boring. Mm. But you know what? I committed a mistake mm. because brand new could be the opposite for second hand. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So, as you said. Um, Shabby looking could be the opposite of classy. Classic. Classy. Okay, and second hand is a brand new. Um, uh, trendy, it's a... Um, So 
sorry. Yeah, it's okay, don't worry. Teacher, don't write. Oh, yes. <laughs> no, it's okay. Mm. Teacher, I, re I, I repeat two letters. Letter, letters. Letter C, no, D. Okay. So, D, I guess the first one, second hand, it's correct with brand mm -hmm. new. And D, shabby looking i think that the opposite of shabby looking is a classy classy yeah because you know what the shabby looking is not only old it's like the 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 homeless homeless style for example when i wash my clothes okay I have a shabby looking. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Plain pink. And do, teacher? Do is whenever something is very boring. What's me? Uh, for example. Very boring? Um, not only boring, but also um do can be for example when you see an old lady who is wearing a, uh -huh. a pair of pigtails in their in her head in her in her hairstyle uh -huh. so she looks childish it can be do or for example people who don't wear any colorful clothes Nothing fashionable, nothing attractive. For example, as you said, that many people wear also in, only only in black. Uh, I think it is very good. Cool. I don't have an idea now. I think that the opposite could be colorful. Colorful? Uh -huh. Yeah, the opposite. And plain, teacher? Ah, plain means whenever... The plain, you... the plain not color? Uh, no, plain is... The, the opposite is when no. you have some images in the clothes, for example... Uh, when you have stripes, uh -huh. it is uh, well plain. Uh -huh. Don't have anything like that. Uh, that that kind of of wearing is called uh, patterned. Yeah, when okay. you have flowers. Because teacher, when you go to the store and you look, to, to, yes, the the clothes say the plain one. Price and the uh, lines or other is other price. Yeah, pattern. Well, is it, it, it burns or or other colors or well other lines or well uh, flowers wow. or whatever uh, they have other price. Wow, mm -hmm. I didn't know that. Here in Mexico, I think. <laughs> <laughs> no, I I'm learned here that 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 uh, that teacher in, in the stores. And wow. Teacher and and well, I put the letter G G G. Uh huh. In the partner, is correct, teacher. Uh huh. I think that H is patterned. Yes. Here. J. Wow. Do all right, yes, it can also be. Hey, you are very good. Teacher, how, how many are wrong? Well, let's check. In the case of long, the opposite is short, of course. Uh, whenever we talk about second hand, the opposite is brand new. Very good. 
whenever you talk about comfortable, uh -huh, here we are. The opposite could be uncomfortable, of course, yes. Cheap, expensive. And when you say flat, the opposite is high heeled, tight, baggy, colorful, plain, all right. So patterned, do, all right. Uh, old fashioned, like classy, all right, I think. That in this case, the opposite of old-fashioned is trendy. Okay. In here, I, I would say F. And shabby looking, the opposite could be classy. Yes. That's it. Just this one. Okay, teacher. Old-fashioned. But hey, you're very good. Well, some words I don't uh, want mean. I don't know what mean the, the, some words. Yeah, that's it. Sometimes it is difficult to solve the exercises because of that uh, little situation, uh, that little yeah. problem. But yeah. you know what? There, there are techniques, for example, uh, whenever we infer the meaning of the word. So sometimes we guess what the answer could be. Uh, time ago, a student told me, teacher it is not the case i don't want to be guessing and i said yes you're right of course i agree with you but i don't think that we are going to be in the position to know all of the words in the language yes i know even into our native language we don't know all of the words so yes. don't don't fight don't uh, don't have any problem about looking for the meaning of a new word into the dictionary, for example. Yeah, and and, and, this, and the Spanish is the same. I don't know all the words, uh, Spanish words. Yeah, that's it. Even me, um, I there are some words in Spanish that for me are confusing, and some others are unknown. For me, they were new when I heard them for the first time. Yeah, that's it. In all of the languages, yes. we are yes. going to find that situation. All right. Hello. Yes. Right you know what? It has been a pleasure for me to be working with you today. Unfortunately, we have finished our class. So meet you next class. Have a very wonderful week and enjoy the weather. <laughs> And meet you next class. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. And I hope you feel better for the next time. Uh, I will. I promise to. Do, do you remember that the last week I couldn't speak any? I was totally voiceless. But now yes, I, I know. <laughs> yes. I am on my way to, to get better. Okay. Thank you. It's, it's good, teacher. Have a very yes. good enjoy, night. Enjoy the, the, the vacation. Likewise. Thank you. Have a Thank good night. Thank you very much. Good night. Okay.